just going back to our last couple games, it's certainly been nice to not only be victorious, but to do it on the road in a tough environment at St. Joe. And our team really pulled together, played tremendous team defense. We got a collective offensive balance. Uh, kids really responded. And I told them the other day that if I could close my eyes and open my eyes and look at the look on their faces after that win, it's something as a coach you want to bottle up and, and uh, remember for a long time. We'd like to have more of those moments. LaSalle poses a very athletic team. They've had great success early in the season. It's been one of their most successful seasons in the Athletic 10. They've had some very, very good wins, knocking off ECU and George Washington, um, a team that uh, I think Jeff really believes can, can, can do some, some good things this year. Played Richmond the other day, had a tough loss at home, didn't shoot the ball very well, but they're very capable shooters. Uh, Cropper is, a, is an unbelievable guard um, and, and has picked up the scoring since their point guard went down with an injury, season ending injury. And their post player inside, their Pittsburgh transfer, is, is, a, is, a, is a very, very uh, good post player inside. They can score inside out. They'll want to turn us over uh, with their athleticism. Uh, I'm expecting a, a zone defense, a press defense, and some aggressive man to man. Um, and our team, again, we have to play well at home. We've done well now on the road. We try to string a third one here together. We're going to have to bring it because uh, we can't be satisfied with just winning on, on Wednesday against St. Joe. We have to take a uh, very detailed approach, a uh, very team defensive approach against a really athletic team, um, rebound the basketball, and, and make shots. I mean, it really it helps a lot when the ball goes in the basket. And, and right now we're shooting better. I'd like that to continue. I'd like our free throw percentage to improve a little bit. But uh, we're going to have to roll our sleeves up. There's nobody in this league um, that you can just show up and play. And uh, hopefully uh, we come out with a high level, level of energy. Uh, we're going to partner back to back with the men's team. Our, our, our men's team is going for their 20th win uh, to come to play right after them. Hopefully the fans will stay and, and cheer us on and uh, help celebrate our, our Breast Cancer Awareness Day. Uh, breast cancer has touched all of our lives in many, many different ways. And, and uh, please come out and support the efforts for breast cancer as well as a uh, great day for building basketball.